Hi everyone, it is September 11th, 2019. In this video, I'm gonna give you an update on the roof coating for the truck camper. Um, back in June of 2017, I applied a Tropical coating to the top of our truck camper, and that's a Henry product. We got it at Home Depot. I have had more questions about how that's holding up for us than probably any other question. Okay, I'm standing on the bed up through the uh, roof hatch that's over the top of it, and here's the roof. As I said before, this is the Henry Tropical coating that was applied in early June of 2017. The video is uploaded, I think, on June 20th, but I actually applied this a little bit before then. It's very dirty. Um, if I came up here and, and washed this with like just a, a soft brush and garden hose and some soap, I believe that this would clean up pretty nice and look pretty darn white still. Uh, we got some like that's just that's dirty stuff that would wash right off of there um, There's no flaking there's no um, may, You know that's dust from like, you know the the dirt and stuff. That's not chalking off of the the roof I've overlapped it over the top of some of this tape, like the, I think it's called Durabond tape. They sell it for, you know, sealing up around RV penetrations and stuff. And in a few places where it's on top of the tape, which is, I don't think, really adequately prepared for uh, coating, it's doing something like this. Like it's got a little bit of a, a flake there. Um, let's see if I can find another one. Here. This is like I said, this is over the top of some tape and it's not really applied to the thickness, you know, proper thickness probably that the rest of the, uh, the roof is. Um, this other part though is applied directly onto the metal and it's holding up great, like all over. It's, it's doing what, it, what we wanted it to do. Um, we have gone many many thousands of miles banging up and down dirt roads in some very intense and hot sun uh, we live in texas there's the texas sun right there and this thing has sat out uh, uncovered we never had it under anything because we just don't have anything to park it under and it's been exposed to all of that it's had snow on it it's been in ice it's had ice formed on top of it and it's still going strong like I see like I'm really rubbing on it and you know we've gone underneath trees that you know have scraped the top and stuff so there's like I see a couple of places there's some like scratches and scuffs it looks like but it's not you know it's not really coming apart or off in any place so I am happy with it like totally satisfied like who wouldn't be right I mean that's what you want you want it to last a long time it's now 2019 and it's still looking really good and it still feels good it's not no problems okay I'm back inside the camper now um trying to think if there's anything else I'd like to add um I'm gonna put links to my previous videos where I talk about the the roof coating um, and those will be down below in the description this is applied on a metal roof the the top of this camper is aluminum and if you go and watch the very first video where I'm applying it you can kind of see the shape that the roof was in before um, it had some sort of paint on it, and it wasn't like a rubberized coating or anything, and I don't know what it was, but it was on there whenever we bought the camper, and it was in terrible shape. Like, it was chalking, and it had actually come off in a lot of spots, and I spent a very good deal of time prepping this roof before I applied the coating because I have learned from previous 
mistakes that lack of preparation can be the difference between success and failure. And whenever you're going to spend um, a lot of money on a product, we just, we, all we needed for this was one gallon because it's pretty small, but it's still really expensive stuff. And like, you don't want to go to all that trouble and everything and then have it not work because you didn't spend the time you needed to, to uh, prep the surface. So I got every single bit of any part of that coating that was on there before off. Um, some of it was so stuck on still that there were places, a few places spotty over the top where that was still there. And I just went over the top of it finally with the, the Henry Tropical stuff. But uh, it it's not delaminating anywhere and um, I guess that's, that's the update on the roof. And if y'all have got any questions or comments, you can leave them down below. And as always, thank you very much for watching. Bye, y'all.